Hasn't put on the robe yet. We're not recording, right? Yeah, it's, it's recording. Mm. Uh, I mean, he I always just this. like, me. <laughs> I won't cut this. Me. He never cuts it. I leave it. Well, I cut normally snippets. Snippets. No matter how bad it is. Wonder how dumb it is. <laughs> <laughs> but the number the better, right? So do I really want to talk about this? Nah, let's cut it. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Hell, yeah. Demonetized. <laughs> like we were I was gonna say something <laughs> else. <laughs> like, like, like we're getting anything anyway. <laughs> Are you right? <laughs> well, Zig Zion people, welcome to Toddy Rap, where that one time I reincarnated as a boss podcaster. Posker. I was gonna say Wait, Posker you again. Do it again. I was gonna say Posker again. You should, you should do it again. No, I'll leave it no, in. No, I'll no, do it again. I'll leave both of them. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Have you guys seen my phone real quick, you know, before we get too far into the podcast? Um, so uh, it, it was there. <laughs> it was there. So Eddie put it, so that means he moved it. Oh, that means it's back there. Perfect. I, I, I got you, I got you, I got you. Yeah, you know, I got stuff on yeah, there that's uh, important I with, the, uh, with what we're going to talk about. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but yeah, welcome to Reincarnate as a podcast for the show where uh, my friends shit on my favorite franchises. Uh, so we're talking about hentai today. <laughs> we're, talking, yes. oh, no, we're talking about Hellboy and how bad it is. Uh huh. And then Huggy Guillermo is the worst director ever. Uh huh. Yeah, uh, okay. Uh, hot take. Okay. We, we already okay. let him talk about how good he was. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, so that's uh, <laughs> reverse the script. It's the it's a great roast of everything I I, I know and love. <laughs> but today Not everything mostly yeah. everything mostly everything. <laughs> so today we are going to talk about Mobile Suit Gundam. Yeah, Gundam. <laughs> Yeah. I mean, yes. I, I don't know if there's light novels for Gundam. There is. Oh. I've right never on. read them. Oh, no, but I think bullshit. they're. Uh, uh, or is it just manga? No. There's manga. Is Thunderbolt a manga? I think they made it a. Ma no, it's not a light novel. Thunderbolt? Sure. Not dude, that's like that's a claymation anime. Yes. <laughs> yes. Is Thunder that like Thunderbolt fantasy? Is that no, what it was? No, no. <laughs> no. I don't know if there, there is novels. Because something we're going to talk about today comes from a novel. Gundam. 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 Yeah, because something we're talking about today does come from a novel. Uh. But we'll, we'll get to that when we get to it. Uh, I think it's a manga. Yeah, yeah, Thunder, it's Thunderbolt. It's a manga? Because the, the, ones, the ones I've always wanted are, what, you know, when you go to Barnes & Noble and they have, like, the, the hardcover origin ones. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, those are dope. Mm, <laughs> those are worth the money. Yeah. I was say. Yeah, those are dope. I'm surprised you don't have them already. I, I thought about it, but I haven't gone there in a while. So. What has been years? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't gone there in a long time. Before we get too far, I totally forgot. So you know how when you have your phone, and if you have Amazon open, then you close it. When you open it again, it normally shows you what you're last looking at. Uh, yeah. So remember, I showed you that Nicolas Cage inside the banana. Yes. <laughs> That's what I opened to. He's shirtless inside like a <laughs> banana, like cut off <laughs> at his waist. And I'm like... Oh yeah! <laughs> oh yeah! I remember this. She started yeah. GoFundMe to get that million dollars to have him as a guest for an hour. Oh! I think we can have him longer than that because for a movie, <laughs> <laughs> which I'm pretty sure so lasts more so than one think, day. So you think there's like a prorated, like, I don't know, yeah, amount yeah. of money? Like, hey, we want you for an hour just for a podcast. Can you? Just... Oh, maybe. Or we pay the million dollars <laughs> and we get him for like six podcasts. Well, <laughs> <laughs> the last three he doesn't speak. He's just there. <laughs> we put him in the background, <laughs> like he's a figure. Oh he's, just, he's, just like, oh, yeah. <laughs> he's just a prop at the point. <laughs> it's like right, Nicholas Cage. He goes. It's, it's, not, it's like, the best, the best performance he's ever done. It'll be like Willy's Wonderland Second all over again. Second best performance. It'll be like Willy's Wonderland all over again. Uh, such a good movie. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. But yeah, Mecca's going pew pew. Yeah, yeah. Pew pew, my well, favorite. Well, they sometimes go pew pew. It's a lot more like people go, mur, 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 mur. and then if you watch it, like I do, it's mur, 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 mur. You know, like, like speed read. <laughs> speed read. <laughs> if he blinks, he misses like three scenes. So, uh, I guess I'll start off. I've never seen, well, I've seen one Gundam, and that was Unicorn mm -hmm. in all of my life. The worst one. Best, <laughs> best design. Not even. See, I like Gundam for their designs. And I will tell you, I decided to sit through all the original Gundam movies. Or I guess it's well, the so Gundam you, show just so you went, slapped down. Yeah, you went through 
the three original Gundam recap movies. Yes. The ones where they That's took need. the ones where they I took know, the original so run <laughs> and they compressed it into three films. They went from sixteen hours to seven. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good deal. Yep. And I watched like a two for one. And I watched that one point five, so that compresses it to like <laughs> even further <right>. four. <laughs> but I had to read all of it because no English. No English. No English. No, no English. Dang. Which is fine, you know. Did it still have like the the opening at the beginning of the movies? I think it had the opening at the beginning, and then had some music at the end. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, you know, it's really hard to tell what's what when you're watching it at one point five. So you still got all the blends you still got the straight fire first gun yeah. opening. <laughs> like garbage fire. No, like, like fire. it's amazing. It's so, like it's it's seventies to yeah, the max. It's a seventies fucking <laughs> opening. So it's I've never seen Gundam and I was all unicorn, but that was a long time ago. And I was like, you know, I'll start with the old original granddaddy one. I don't know, dude. I thought you, you saw the best Gundam one already. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Darling Franks? Oh, Darling. Yeah, yeah, dude. Darling's my favorite Gundam. <laughs> I like that part where they were like banging, but they were just in a suit. <laughs> what? That's the whole show. They're banging, but they're in suits. Mm -hmm. I like how their robots have faces. <laughs> they have facial expressions. <laughs> But anyway, yeah, you watched Anyway, so, so I watched Unicorn. I like the design. I've always like looked at the figures, and I'm like, oh, you know, these designs are cool. Yeah. Fuck the first season. All of them, <laughs> all of them, except the original, and I will say, are just garbage. It's so true. They're all round. There's a tank Gundam. It's like a magic Gundam that's cut off at the top. Uh huh. And it it sits like this as like turrets for the hands. Wow. And it's on treads. That was a little hate to be that person, but I don't think, I, 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 if I remember correctly, I think only one of them is a Gundam suit. I don't know. They, they were all called, like, Because they're all, they're all, uh, men, 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 probably. And then they also had another Gundam that was a suit. <laughs> I thought it were Man. Gundams because they're made out of a certain material. No. No, it depends on, e it depends on which one you're going with. Um, I mean, so the original run is UC Gundam, right? Sure. Uh, sure. Yeah, sure. <laughs> it's a. Uh, it's what started the UC timeline. Original um, timeline. Original character timeline. Talk about timelines, yeah. bro. Yeah. There's so many. Well, there's like, Too there's many. one main one. Yeah. And then there's everything else. <laughs> <laughs> and each each one of those has its own individual shit. You don't worry. About it. They're they're self contained. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, they're self contained. <laughs> so what from the movie? I remember they called it the Tank Gundam. Okay. And then they had this Gundam suit that looked like... Imagine Transformers, right? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Now think of the the dumbest one you can think of. And now see. smooth him out. Like, just make him, like, bubbly, yeah. maybe. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's what he looked like. Yeah. And he had cannons on his shoulder. Like, he's like, um... War to or no, no, sorry. Blastoise. Blastoise. So, so, but some, would <laughs> some would say that the sign is better than 86, man, because... I agree with that. Fuck those man, <laughs> <laughs> Uh, keep going, but, uh, but I mean, but yeah, I mean that's the thing, right? So each each one's different. Like no matter depending on what series you went through, they have different definitions of what makes a mobile suit a Gundam. Mm -hmm. uh, you see, that it's just what they call them. They're supposed to be like the top top of the line, the top tier. Yeah, the top tier ones. From what I remember, they just called everything Gundams in that movie. Because I don't think they call this, I don't think they call the Zaku's Gundam. Yeah, they do. Did they? Yeah. Oof. They just called everything. It was like, oh, they sent out their Gundam, and then they had like a name for it. Uh, weird. Mm -hmm. So to me, I was just like, everything's Gundam, I guess. Because be, I mean, I, as time progresses, it becomes all more differentiated. That's what like, is what we, is what? In Gundam Wing, the Gundams they're top of the line, but they're also made of Gundanium or whatever. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's like a, a special metal. Yeah. It's a I know. Metal I know Gundam. his was something special because like they shot it, and he was like, oh, I can take that shot. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> also, and then later on, it didn't seem like that Gundam armor was very strong, because then the same bullet decided to damage the whole fucking thing. So I'm like, oh, okay. Maybe they upgraded their blasters. That's because they broke their shield, and then it was just health at that point. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. They never recharged. Video game mechanics. <laughs> yeah. It just doesn't recharge anymore. Yeah, dude. You have to punch to recharge. They had the skull on. No, sweet. So you went through the origin films, okay, yes. yes, yes, and then, and then I just Char's counterattack. Yes, because you're like, because I wanted to watch the new one since the new one came out finally, or yeah. like, the movie's coming out. Well, the first one, so yeah. it came out Thursday. It's a Saturday, and I was like, <laughs> I'll watch it. So I watched it this morning, and I did love Char, uh, uh, Char's counterattack. Char's counterattack. 
That's when you start seeing actual Gundams. Yeah, that's good. It's ten years later. The animations up yep. way better. Uh -huh. You know, original animations. No, nah. <laughs> I wouldn't say it's not great, but it's good for its time. Yeah. If that makes sense. It was revolutionary. <laughs> sure. Yeah. Sure. Like some of it, I could see like the bright effects, like when it's the bright greens uh -huh. or the glowing swords or something. I'm like, ah, oh, I can see that being pretty crazy to draw. I do like the sound effects. In the original yeah. ones. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. And I watched Char's... Uh, Char's... Char Charizard's counter attack. Charizard's counter attack, dude. Yeah, he down beat and it was crazy. I guess he has a counter attack. OP. Did like that one way better. Characters are way good. Yeah. It's just just better. It's, it, Char's counter attack is a, is a classic. It's just a good... It's a film. Yeah. It's a good movie. Okay. Like, the, the mobile suit designs are fucking great. I mean, some of the characters are more bearable. Uh, I have a whole <laughs> list of shit I forgot to start with. Oh, okay. So, uh, let's, let's hear it. So it starts off, the Gundam, the original Gundam, uh -huh. it starts off with this asshole kid named... I'm right? Yeah, gay-ass dude. <laughs> yeah, pisses it. me off so much. So he he's like a lazy guy, and uh, they're under like a strike. Like, they're going to be attacked. Uh -huh. Imagine you just, like, we're in our house, and they're like, oh, the Gundams are coming down to kill all of us. <laughs> So they have to evacuate, and they evacuate everyone, and he's just like, I don't fucking want to go, and then he leaves, trying to, he tries to find his dad, too. His dad's a Gundam suit maker? Engineer? Yeah, something like that. And he finds him, and he's like, oh, I found you, I'm so happy, he's like, oh, get out of here, I gotta save this guy, he's like, is life's more important, or Gundam more important than lives? And he just leaves. It's like, I guess the answer was yes. Uh, the answer is yes. <laughs> Fuck that dad, too, by the way. <laughs> uh, oh, and then you meet... <laughs> I didn't know who was best boy at the time. I wrote, then you meet blonde boy with 20-foot range kick. Because he's like, he's like, held at gunpoint. <laughs> and dude, you, it's like, I'm holding you at gunpoint, you're over here, and I'm over there. Uh -huh. And then you do a front kick, and my gun goes flying. Hell yeah. And I'm like, dude, that guy's got some range on this guy. <laughs> Right. You just gotta, you gotta stretch your tippy toes. That's, that's what he did. That's, like <laughs> show, is that, that's when they show Char, right? That's the first day. Yeah, that, that's that's blonde boy. That's best boy. <laughs> uh, I think the kid learns how to use a Gundam suit somehow by reading a manual that he found on the floor. As you, as you do. As you do. Yeah. 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 It's like, like how to pilot a, a <laughs> complicated. It's under suit. like a tarp, and the people die, and he's like, "I'm gonna get in this Gundam." He's like, "Got this book." Dude, I remember that whenever I'm in a plane that's going down, I'm going walk to the cockpit and I'm like, oh, so where's the instruction manual? No, you, I mean you just you just learn on the spot, dude. Yeah. It's, it's like how I learned how to drive a skid steer. It's the same thing. Get in the skid. You what? Oh, you know what a skid steer is? No. It's like a forklift, oh. except you can also put a bucket on it to lift up dirt. Nice. Okay, it's, a, it's a, you know construction, yeah, yeah, but yeah. but at the same time, it's like that's how you learned. I'm mm -hmm. like, because the, the first time, like the guy I was working, was like, do you know how to drive one of these? I'm like, no. He's like. You know how to drive like a, a lawnmower? Like one of them. I'm like, sure. Same thing. Get in there, you'll figure out the rest. <laughs> that's what this kid needed to do. With Pretty the much. That's what he did. <laughs> he's just like, fuck it. And then he's I like, can do it. He's <laughs> fucking stabbing people. <laughs> he's doing like max flips. Borderline illegal. It's bullshit. Yeah. Yeah. Imagine you're on the other guy's team. And you're a trained soldier. <laughs> and then you have this jackass <laughs> that's learning five seconds. So you know, the usual gun the bullshit the is he's fucking 16. Uh -huh. You know, yeah, as yeah, all yeah, gun yeah. is. Well, you have to be a kid. He's to a be gamer. A, yeah, he's a game, <laughs> gamer kid. And, oh man, so he, you know, he kills everyone because bullshit or whatever. <laughs> and then there, he's like... He's gifted. All I remember is they send him on the... Uh, White base is what they call it, uh -huh. which is the uh, Trojan horse. Yeah, yeah, which yeah, is yeah, another yeah. garbage design. Yeah, that's the ship. And so they get on there, and he's you know resting, and they're being attacked, and he's like, I don't want to go fight because uh, he's he's he's, he's, do, he's pulling a Shinji. Yeah, mm. he's he's he is the original Shinji archetype. So <laughs> I think it was Char's sister steals the suit, goes tries to fight it, gets all fucked up. They bring it back. And they're really like, they, I guess they ran away or something, I can't uh -huh. remember. She goes to jail in that little prison thing, and they're like, you did something wrong, you stole the thing. And like, the reason why she stole it, I think, I can't remember if he says it or she says it, it was like, I wanted to see if girls are as good as boys. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? The 70s. <laughs> they used a shit ton in this movie. That didn't age well. Nope. nope. <laughs> well, maybe not here. Maybe in Japan. 
Maybe Japan is still okay. They throw her in jail, and she's like, oh no, I'm locked away. They start fighting again. Uh -huh. They open her jail because it's been five minutes, I guess. <laughs> it's time to move on. <laughs> Who gives a shit? <laughs> so she fights again anyway. He gets back in the suit. He kills another couple of guys. He goes crazy again. And so there's this one love interest that has... Mm -hmm. So it's the main girl, I yeah, guess yeah, his childhood yeah. friend or whatever. So she's... She's always like nice to him, but he he gets he's hot after the the captain, which is one of them's like a girl. Mm. She's like an older lady, uh -huh. and then he meets another older lady that he wants to bang. And they a, all die. He's he's in a milfs. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> he's sixteen. Yeah. So he's out there, he's out there fighting, and I think he's about to like get attacked from behind. So the one milf jumps in the fucking plane, flies out to go save his ass. And she just fucking gets fucking slumped like that. Because she's, she's in like a fighter jet slam. She dies. I'm like, okay, one down. Later on, you meet this other one uh -huh. who is on the bad guy's side. And I think she's going to attack him. And he's like, I don't want to kill you. And then another Gundam comes out of nowhere, smashes <laughs> her. I'm like, everyone just dies the same. They all get fucking hammer fisted. That's how like, I want to go. Get hammer fisted get by hammer a Gundam. Fisted. Yeah. I know he <laughs> runs away at some point. He gets thrown in jail for MIA. And then there's a fight going on. They pull him out of the jail because five minutes have passed. Uh -huh. <laughs> they have been in jail twice. No, two different people. Two different people. You had, blonde, you had blonde chick and then you had main boy. Mm -hmm. They went to jail and they came out. They're both garbage characters. No, the blonde chick's not bad. Mm -hmm. I think she dies too. I can't remember. I'm not, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I think I like the Zeon characters so much more than the Federation ones. When oh, it comes fuck to, all the Federation. When it the comes to good, original Gundam. The only good Federation characters are the kids. They're funny as <laughs> shit. There's like these three kids that are probably like Five maybe max. <laughs> Why are they fighting? Huh? Why are they fighting? I don't know. Um, Motherfucker. I, I really don't know. <laughs> so th they were all one thing. Zeon secedes because they're based in space. So yeah, yeah, so yeah. the the whole universal century timeline thing is at the beginning of it. Humans went to space because there wasn't enough room on Earth. Right. Yes. Yeah, yeah. That, so that's that, that, that's UC1. Yeah. yeah, that's yeah. U, that's UC1, which Unicorn touches on a little yeah, bit. I understood yeah. that. Ooh. They go into space, and then after like 80 years, because I think original Gundam's UC78. Yeah, so True. 80 years, they Zeon splits because they're like, nah, fuck you guys. We want to govern ourselves in space. I want to be their independent colony. Yeah, yeah, yeah. which is fine. And then, but and they're then, fucking, nice to do. And then there's they, like four different groups fighting each yeah. other at some point. You're like, who the fuck are these then guys? They, then there's like we, they have weird ideas. They think humanity will evolve in space. Yeah. Okay. And then you have the whole like new type debate. Oh yeah. Because that's a big thing. I didn't quite they, understand the new type thing. I thought it was just new type of Gundam. <laughs> so no, I understood it. Like, it it's people. It's evolved people. So the people, like, evolve in space, and because they're, like, I, I think, yeah, okay. So it, because they're, like, uh, what's the word? Exposed okay. to, like, certain things and stuff, like, in the mobile suits, and depending on how the, like, when the mo how the mobile suits evolve, they get exposed to, like, weird shit, and they become, they start getting, like, extra, like, powers. Yeah, yeah. Like, intuition and weird yeah. shit. Yeah. yeah, you can kind of see it in the first one, and I guess in the newest one, but it was just, like... I don't know what they're talking about, new types. I just thought I was like... No, because that's what it yeah, is. It's, it's evolved yeah. people, and the Federation's like, no, people don't evolve in space. And Zeon's like, yeah, they do. <laughs> <laughs> and and it's, it's supposed to explain, like, the weird, the bull, like, the protagonist bullshit. Yeah. You know? That you get in later Gundams as well, at least in the UC timeline. Because I'm raised that way. And yeah. Later, he slowly starts becoming OP with his Gundam. <laughs> yeah. And Char is the same way. Okay, but is this main character... The one that becomes OP, or is he the one that fucking dies? I don't got no, he becomes OP because I don't think he dies. Does he become God? No, no. no does no. he become he, one he, with he, his he, machine? He, does, he doesn't reach like fucking unicorn <laughs> levels where he becomes no. like a literal God. <laughs> so the first two movies happen. <laughs> I'm like, I was just like, they just happen. They just happen. <laughs> we're, we're done with them. Who gives a shit? Now, the third one. I don't have much written on here for the third one. But it takes three movies for this goddamn mo show, I guess, uh -huh. to go to space. Yep. This uh -huh. is the, finally the first space scene <laughs> in the whole movie. 
And then everyone dies. <laughs> everyone dies. I wrote, um, <laughs> what the fuck is this? Is it a harem? Or Gundam's harem, Zeddy? No. The first one is definitely a harem. Because you have... IBO is technically a harem. <laughs> Because the first... Okay, you got it. <laughs> the only one guy. I know. Well, he wasn't a pilot. No, he was a pilot. Then he, then he fucking died. They murked my boy. Because <laughs> in this one, so you, have, you have main boy, uh -huh. who yeah. has childhood friends. Yeah, yeah. Who just gets dissed off 90% of the movie. And then, As childhood friends do. Yeah. And then you <laughs> have Milf, who didn't really like him anyway, because was, she was married. Uh -huh. She died. Yeah, and she died. Oh, yeah, Milf died. Milf number two... <laughs> Who was on the bad guy side? Who died? They had a dark skin, I think, like Indian chick. Oh yeah. She kind of yeah. had that vibe. Yeah. And so you meet her. She has this like weird mind link thing, and she fucking she's like trying to bang fucking Char and uh, Amaretto at the same fucking time. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. That's whatever. I'm a day old. Seventies. And then so you got her, and then she fucking dies because. Uh, Char and uh, Amadeus is fighting in, in I space. I got different one each time. <laughs> <laughs> They're fighting in space, and she's like, "Don't hurt him!" And then fucking uh, Amaretto fucking stabs through the the. Gundam, like, it dies and she blows up and they're all sad now. Is it really a harem if they're not all alive at the same time? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> they're all trying to bang him through these fucking four movies. So if you want to bang him, you die. Yeah, basically. Mm -hmm. so, uh, sounds, sounds like a... a sound, sounds like traditional uh, Gundam. <laughs> Gundam well, logic. <laughs> so my thought, I thought uh, at the end of this, one of the two main characters would die. Like Char or... Amaru, but they don't. Uh, Amadeus. <laughs> and I don't understand. So is Char now still with the other side, or is he a third division now in Char's counter attack? Counter -attack? Because he, because in the second one they were trying to like blow up Earth or something or kill someone. Whoa! And then he shoots other milf, mm -hmm. another milf that came out of nowhere. She he he blows her head off throughout the spaceship, and he he was on her side. Char, I think, I think Char is there. I, he kind of he, he has his own armor. Yeah, he he, he kind of runs on his own. Okay, so he, he's just the guy. He goes to the beat of his own drum. Okay, is there a guy with a red suit and a mask? That's that's that's, that's Char. That's yeah. my boy. Yep, yeah, yeah, he does. Yeah, he's yeah. Best boy. <laughs> <laughs> he does. Damn, I forgot something. I can't remember what it was. But yeah, he kind of like I think he comes up in Zeon just because. It's like convenient for him. Okay. But he kind of just he goes to the beat of his own. He's just there in every fight because he also sacrificed what's his name, the purple haired dude. Uh huh. There, yeah, that's like in second movie. I forgot. So they're fighting, uh, like Andrew or whatever, and uh, the other guy. <laughs> oh, Andrew and Char were fighting, and then Char is like, "Oh, they hid somewhere." Go find him, purple haired dude. And he's like, oh, they must have went that way. He gets fucking shot in the back. They blow up. And he's like, I lied to I him. I found you, bitch. <laughs> I lied to him. They all died. And it was my fault. But I didn't tell anyone. And you're like, what was that? Wait, in this show, is there like a princess or like a, a peacekeeper type of character? I don't think the original has that. What? No. What kind of Gundam is that? I don't think the original has that. No. There's not no. a real Gundam. I guess the only one that was considered most of most of UC Gundam doesn't have that. I consider oh, that time. <laughs> I consider the Indian chick the peacekeeper. Yeah, she was yeah, through all yeah. of movie three, so uh, probably episode forty through the well, end. She died, right? Of course, yeah. Because UC Gundam is just everybody dies. That's the best way to describe what UC Gundam is. Right. Just, Pretty much. No matter what, no matter what, se those. no matter what series you go through in UC, except for maybe like Unicorn, uh -huh. but even then, the the traditional thing is. Everybody's gonna die. <laughs> Which I'm fine with. But you know, all the characters that did die either didn't give two shits nah. about, or the ones that should have died are alive still. Mm -hmm. Like, whatever that fucking main character is. <laughs> Char does die. No, not Char. You know. I know, but Char does die. Does he? He technically does. Because after, like, after, after Counter Attack. No, die. he dies in Counter Attack. I really wasn't sure. <laughs> Because, yeah, I know I watched because it, but I was any, like, if you watch any one that takes place after Counterattack, it's always under the assumption that Char is dead. Okay. Because Unicorn's the same way. Because okay. Unicorn takes place after. 
uh, and uh, the that that red guy I can't remember his fucking name, but yeah. the, the one that also wears the red one yeah, and the yeah, mask, yeah, yeah. he calls himself the, like the second coming of Char because yeah, yeah. Char Whoa. fucking disappeared or some shit he's or died. Dead. He's not dead. Yeah, and that and that's why he uses his weird his uh, Sinanju and stuff and makes it look like the Zazabi and no, whatever no. his mobile suit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then obviously in the newer film, whenever we get to that, that guy is also called like you know the second coming of Char or some yeah, shit. We're almost there. So Char's <laughs> counterattack. <laughs> Ten years later, better movie <laughs> designs, way better. <laughs> Voice acting better. And then we go back to the harem. So <laughs> <laughs> the main harem of the old dead <laughs> main boy. Uh-huh. Uh, whatever. Um, Amadeus? Um, Amadeus, yeah. Okay. Uh, um, Amadeus. He comes um, back. Um, like, Amadeus, Amadeus. <laughs> he comes back as main character again, and Char, I guess, is still main character. Yeah, yeah. Oh, man, we casted yeah. him as main character. Yeah. Yeah. So, okay. So, Char looks way different. He's, like, more buff. He He's uh-huh. like what happens in Resident Evil, how Chris becomes the big buff dude by yep. the end of, like, what, four or five? Or yeah, five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He gets big, yeah. yeah. So, he, he does the same exact thing. I think yeah. he punches a boulder at some point. <laughs> As you do when you that you're that way. So you're like, oh, he's still cool, whatever. So Amadeus now has, you meet a uh, younger blue hair, like a light blue haired chick who's uh, really kind of annoying, but she's oh, yeah, not yeah. a bad character. They're going to say kind of hot. Yeah. <laughs> like, I, that's what I thought. <laughs> like, oh. She's kind of hot. <laughs> so she comes out and she's like, oh, I want to be with uh, Amadeus because... He has Reasons. powers. I don't know. Because he's a fucking new type. Yeah, yeah basically. That's basically <laughs> she's a new type. I think this is where you see all the more. Yeah, new that's when you start seeing them all. And then, you, you remember childhood friend from the last one? Yeah. She's gone. I don't know where she went. She she fucked off somewhere. She, she did. She married someone. And she's gone. So now you meet new girl who's short haired, dark blue girl. And you're like, is that the same girl? I guess not. I don't know. <laughs> so they're trying to bang. But then, I don't know, there was like, this one was like more of a triangle, because then like the, the younger one wanted to bang Char and Amadeus, but then there's this other new type guy that wanted to bang her, but it was like, didn't work out because, you know, wasn't buff and punching boulders. <laughs> <laughs> so. Are they in space still? They're this still one, this, in space. This, this, this is all this, in this space. Okay. Okay. The first yeah. scene is them fighting in space. Fuck I was yeah. like, <laughs> <laughs> like, they did it, guys. They're still in space. Shit happens to the movie. I don't remember most of it except a lot of fighting. Tons of fighting. There's a lot of that. And I'm like, oh, that's good. And then all I remember is at the end, Char's trying to crash a like meteor into the earth to poison it to kill the humans. Uh-huh. But the Federation's trying to stop it. So Char and the Federation are fighting. And then you have, I don't even know if the other fucking guys came in this movie. Oh, yeah, yeah, the, yeah. The other side. Uh-huh. And then Char loses the fight. He's now in a little pod that they grab. Now they're trying to hold the meteor from crashing in the earth. That's all I really remember. Because <laughs> he, he tries that. to do what he did in the first one. When he dropped the colony on the fucking other one. <laughs> That's fucking yeah, people much. die. <laughs> it was a shit time. <laughs> well, well, what they did was they stopped it because, you know, his Gundam's really strong. So he's sitting there holding it and the people are coming with their Gundam's. But they're weak, so they explode. And he's like, no, why are you dying? Yeah. <laughs> My funniest thing, he's like, I don't understand this. So he's like, I'm going to stop the, the meteor by myself and all the, to save the world. And all these other people are trying to stop it, too. And he's like, why are you all dying to stop the meteor, right? Because they don't want the Earth to die, too, you asshole. <laughs> <laughs> you were not going to stop the whole meteor by yourself. He's got the Messiah complex, dude. Yeah, fuck that guy. I wish he died in that movie. <laughs> That's why Char's best boy. <laughs> he didn't blast the meteor with his like cannon. No, it's like it's big. Just shoot it three times. Like Two hundred city <laughs> blocks. <laughs> uh, what's funny when you now you mentioned Char's counterattack? There was a there was a poll right in Japan like oh, yeah. look at a couple of years ago. There you go. Asking like what everyone's favorite Gundam design was. They gave Char. No, it's oh. the it's the new Gundam. Ah, uh, okay. Ray, Ray's Gundam is, is. I can see that. Is, con- is one. considered Japan's number, number one, one designed Gundam. I can say that. I say it's a number, you know, probably like three in my mind. Yeah. But but because I do like that design a lot more than the Granddaddy one. But oh yeah, the Granddaddy's yeah. good. It's very. It's very Granddaddy one is ass. <laughs> you think it's ass? It's so blocky. Because it like was easier it, to animate. Oh, for <laughs> sure. <laughs> <laughs> Either the Gundams back then were square. 
Or their balls. What, what, what's like fun, Vector Man. But it's interesting, too, because you'll see other series that'll take this same design and just add a few things to it, and it'll look so good. Because Thunderbolt's that way. Because if you watch Thunderbolt, it's the, it's the granddaddy Gundam. They just make him blue. Like, yeah. the parts are blue. And then they give him, like, floating shields and, like, a couple they, cannons they just, and stuff. They just add to it. And it's like... And it's, mm. It's it's like same with like the Zaku's the fucking round Zeon ones. I hate those. Uh, yeah, but like because you know how Charles looks like, right? Yeah. This red one. Because there's one like that in Thunderbolt, but then they add a few extra spikes and some yeah. extra shit, and it looks dope as fuck. So <laughs> the fucking bubble, that yeah, add shit to it. Yeah. I can Which see is that. funny because Thunderbolt takes place like at the exact same time as the original does. I can see that. It's just somewhere else. Somewhere else. <laughs> they're doing other shit. Yeah, <laughs> they're, they're killing each other somewhere else. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like most wars are. You know? Yeah. <laughs> But, so, uh, so I'm gonna I'm gonna rate some of these. So okay, original let's, let's series, it. yes. <sighs> I can't rate it. I think I put it like a five. Okay. Like like the animation is old, so yeah, it's yeah, okay. Yeah. The story is not super great. Fuck most of the characters. Uh-huh. The fight scenes are decent. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, For the time, I think I give Char like. An 8.5. Yeah. Just his character. No, no, no. Char's kind of Just his character. I'm going to give Char an 8.5. Okay. 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 We'll, we'll shrink it down to uh, Amadeus. Uh-huh. He's like a 2. Or his character. Or Char, character. like, out of 10. 11. 15. Yep. Best like character. That. Best, best that. character. Char is best character, dude. And I'm just like, yeah, this is a good movie. It had good sound effects, yeah. even though... Yeah. You ever listen to sound effects at uh, high speed? <laughs> <laughs> oh, so I did watch all of these at 1.5, uh-huh. except for Char's. I watched that a little slower in the newest ones because I want to get through them. Yeah. It said the speaking is really funny at 1.5 speed. It's like, <laughs> you're like, what the fuck are these guys saying? <laughs> but I've learned, I don't know how I'd watch these movies at one, like normal speed. There oh, is there so no much. Ones. In between, like, nothing. Like, uh-huh. like not even shots that are meant to look good, or, like, I guess they're shots to show you where they're at. Uh-huh. It's, it's, it's like a spaceship or a fucking yeah. field. Establish. Yeah. Establishing shots. And it's, like, I don't know, 20 seconds probably, of like that, because it, I'll be sitting there watching it, and it'll be like, nothing's happening. Oh, something's happening. like, okay, so if that's five seconds at 1.5 speed, that's 10 seconds of nothing happening. <laughs> <laughs> or... There's a lot of dialogue. Yeah. yeah. Even at 1.5 speed, I wasn't speed reading. Like, I was able to read and catch up. That means they were talking that goddamn slow <laughs> in the movie. I was just like, yeah, okay. So, I'm happy I watched these at faster cool. speeds. Faster speeds. <laughs> you watched all of them. I hate it. I hate it. I'm tired of Gundam. Now we've watched the new one. I guess you can talk about this one. Because you, you probably understood more of it than I did. Yeah. The- and this was related the, to the, that timeline. The, yeah, this the, is the right shitty, chart. Well, the, the shitty thing with the like new movie years. is it does require a fair amount of context. <sighs> yes, it does. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and they talk about Char, they're talking about um, um, Amadeus, and uh, Amadeus. And then you meet Hathaway in fucking two. Oh, that's the other boy that is in the love triangle. Yeah. Hathaway. Yeah, uh-huh. Fuck that guy in the other movie. He's not so bad in this one. Yeah. I'm not gonna he grows lie. up. He's a good 50. Yeah. yeah. He grows up. He's a good 50-50. He does the yeah. shitty shit, and then he's not so bad. Because I think his dad's in the original. In no, the original. He's just a, he's a pilot. Oh. Yeah, he's, he's a pilot. He's his dad, probably. Yeah. yeah okay. he's, he's a pilot. And then in, in Charles' counterattack, I think he, he's, the kid steals a, like a, a mobile suit or some shit. Okay. <laughs> sure, <laughs> That's who that character is. Yeah. And it's funny because you actually see the kids from Charles' counterattack in the new movie. He has. There's a couple flashbacks. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. and he, he 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 sees them, and I'm like, oh hey. <laughs> <laughs> I remember those flashbacks. I'm like that's kind of weird, but sure. Yeah, it's just. Because I think they kept the old animation for it too, right? It's close. Yeah, it's like yeah. you're like, oh, that's. Um, but it does require a lot more context. Um, I mean, setting wise, so Hathaway is the new movie. Yeah. Uh, in Hathaway. Japan, it's called Hathaway's Flash. Yeah. Because that is the name of the novels. Okay. Written by I can't remember his name right now, but it's the guy who penned original. Sure. Original Gundam. They take place in UC 109, I believe. Sure. Which mm. is like, it's supposed to be like 10 years, 12 years after Char's Counterattack. I kind of guessed. He was definitely older. Yeah, yeah it says that's like 12 years after Char's Counterattack. Yeah. Uh, Zeon is no longer a thing because they merged with the Federation. Oh, okay. Yeah. Weird. <laughs> At that point. And then obviously, you know, you have the Hathaway character. 
uh, who is kind of, he kind of gives himself his own kind of name, right? Is that, that weird organization he's yeah, a part yeah. of. And he's pretty much trying to push what Char was going for originally, which is push people out of Earth so they can evolve <laughs> into new types. <laughs> Just leave them there. Let them do what they want. <laughs> Fuck. I don't, I don't understand all this fucking like, we gotta have them evolve. We gotta go do this. It's like, just... Let those assholes be unevolved human apes <laughs> and I'll push the space people forward. Yeah, exactly. Because like, uh, that's cares? the whole thing, too. Because it's funny, well, here, uh, outside context, too, you go in a unicorn. Yeah. And at the end of unicorn, they open up, like, fucking Laplace's box or whatever it is, <laughs> right? Yeah. From, like, UC1, that one box. Which is basically, it's like, here's proof that new types exist. <laughs> sure. <laughs> and, and then Gunda Narrative, which is right after that, just goes into that, like, hardcore. <laughs> which, okay. it's funny, because that only takes place, like, a couple years before this movie. This movie happens. Right. So there's that context in there as well. Um, it's a pretty film. <laughs> mm, it's there's a, pretty scenes. It's 100% yeah. of Rotten Tomatoes. What, the one person that voted for it? Probably. Yeah. <laughs> is it one hundred percent user or one hundred percent critic? I didn't say, but it's like ninety five percent user approved. I can see that. I think it's a so I think it's a decent movie. Yes. I mean the movies are rated like seven point eight on average. Yeah. Yeah. Which is decent. Yeah. yeah. Alright, there so to me this show had one and a half good scenes. Mm-hmm. So I think the scene. So you, so you have Hathaway, and you meet this girl, Gigi, Gigi yeah, the cat <laughs> from Kiki's. Uh huh. So, so you meet them too, and she's I don't know, she's a decent character. I like her as a design, uh-huh. but their fucking hotel gets fucking nuked. Uh-huh. Well, the hotel across the street gets nuked, and then, and then their hotel gets yeah. nuked. But uh, they're running away, and during the runaway scene is really good. It's the fight from their perspective. That's and it's so at night. Good. It's, it's very so clean. good. I think the animation that is great for that. sequence is so good. But I think everything else is just eh. The end, <laughs> the end is okay. The end fight scene is decent. It, the end is okay. I think... Uh, and so, when we wa- when I watched that fight scene, uh-huh. the first one, yeah, I was yeah. like, this is really good animation. Uh-huh. And I saw the rest of the fight scenes, I'm like, they spent all the money on the first fight yeah, scene. Yeah. <laughs> all of it. <laughs> It's it's like the combination of like the hand drawn with the CG. Yeah, it looks so. Well, I think it's, it looks so good. I just though. think it's the coloring. Yeah, it's very good. But then once they go into the real fights, yeah. that that coloring, uh-huh. like that darkness, is gone. And you're just like back to normal Gundam. Yeah, bright colors. But that that sequence was like I remember when I was going through that sequence. Like all the little details are so good. Yeah. Like when like the laser beams hit something and like yeah. the, plasma the plasma splashes yeah, yeah. and it like starts to melt shit and stuff like that. Yeah. Like they almost get burned. She loses her bag. Yeah. And, and it's and it's crazy to see a Gundam fight from a human perspective because you're it's like you're on the ground like with them and there's people running and like uh-huh. a giant foot will stomp down and like squish people and they'll be like shifting and buildings are starting <laughs> to come down. Damn. It's very like it's very cinematic. Uh huh. It's audience score. Yeah, it's hundred percent. Yeah, it's 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 very it's a very cinematic. It, it it's a very cinematic film. Mm-hmm. Like a lot of the stuff they do, you could tell is like trying to capture that like movie vibe. Yeah, and it, I don't know. It was like they're trying to go for like it's very James Bondy in a weird way. Yeah, like, yeah, I can see. Like yeah. kind of like spy movie. It, it has that vibe. Yeah, from with like the the opening number. And stuff like that, like yeah, the opening where, song. Where they're on the fucking yeah. Yeah, like the opening song and like the 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 airplane the airplane fight scene mm-hmm. <laughs> and and stuff like that. It's very it does have that that feel to it. No, I definitely felt that. I don't know. There's just some stuff I was just like, this is kind of weird. I, I I feel like it doesn't do a very good job explaining some things. Fuck no. <laughs> no. It's like I remember watching this movie and I'm like, if I did not, if I didn't know like a lot of this other stuff. There's a lot of this that would just go. Whoop. Yeah, we gotta watch the first stuff and Char's uh, counterattack. Yeah. I would have no fucking clue what's going on, like who half these characters uh-huh. were, because they name drop like a dozen, dozen people, and you're like, ah, oh, I remember that name. Because <laughs> like, okay, it, it, it goes with the like assumption, assumption which is that good. That's you, how movies you, should you be. You know all the context of what you see is. Yeah. 
It's like watching a Spider-Man movie and, you know, imagine if you skipped the first one, you would still understand what happened in the first one. Because you're like, oh, his parents or his uncle died, blah, blah, blah. You know the basics. That's what this is. Yeah. It's, it stinks you watch the other one, which is good. Yeah. And I mean, it's a setup film, right? It's it's the first yeah. it's the first of three. Yeah. So it's it it, it has that kind of slower pace, it that the build going. the build up pace. It's three movies. It's three movies of that timeline. Of this, thing. just thing. Mm. It, I mean, if we're gonna go this timeline, I can name a shit ton of them just off the top <laughs> of my head. So, because I, I, yeah. I think it's one of those I'll pro I'll watch through them just because yeah. I've already watched the first one. I have issues, so. I don't know, it was good. It was decent. I I do hope they do more scenes like that in the first one. Yeah. Or even just change your coloring. Because the animation was okay. It was that CG hand-drawn, like, character vibe. Where it was like, it's not shitty CG. And they upgraded it. Mm -hmm. But still not, to me, great. For what I like, at least. So. Yeah. I, I mean, it, it has that style you get used to in films. Um... The, the fate, like the Ufu table stuff, kind of uh, has that feel to it as well. Yeah. Um, some of the Shaft stuff has that feel to it as well. Like the newer Shaft movies, like, like uh, Fireworks, which is great, but the animation's great. And like the Keys of Monogatity movies and stuff like that. It, it does have that, like, that kind of animation vibe that you get from it. But, like, it was fine. Like I said, like, I remember watching it, and every so often I'm just like, this is taking its sweet time to do stuff. But I'm like, but this is the first film. Like, if this was the beginning of a series, like, episode-wise, I'm like, okay, I kind of get it. <laughs> yeah, I still think they took too much time. Yeah, there's a lot of just random dialogue uh -huh. that was very unneeded. Yeah. Like, there's, like, I don't mind. There's the flirting stuff uh -huh. with the main guy and the girl. And you're like, ah, oh, it's fine, whatever. But there's a lot of just dialogue that was explaining stuff that didn't have any, like, to me, context are needed to be there. It was this, just like, let's elongate this. This thing does something that almost every Gundam series does too. Talk? No, yeah, that, that's one. But uh, like, uh, character-wise, you always, almost in every Gundam, you have to have your main character and there's always a rival. Like, an exact uh, opposing, oh, uh, exact opposing I character. I the rival. I don't even know if he's the rival you're talking about. No, yeah, but I mean, I, that's that's kind of like the, the thing, right? Yeah. Uh, and every Gundam does this. I'm a Ray right? Char, right? Like, right. Yeah, that's its own thing. Um, Thunderbolt does the same thing. The main character right. has his exact counterpart. Uh... Uh, unicorn Benazir yeah, and the other yeah, 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 yeah I get yeah, it same. so because <laughs> this one does the exact same yeah. thing right you have the main character in Hathaway and then you have like the captain yeah Kenneth yeah, has oh my god yeah. I don't even know if he's really a rival he's just annoying <laughs> <laughs> so so you remember a main girl is kind of with or flirting with the other main guy so, sure so the captain <laughs> he's like the, the captain is just an asshole <laughs> he's like you want to go back to my place and we can bang and blow <laughs> Like, this is, like, oh. almost word for word. You're just like, what, Chad? You're like, okay. And then he's Th like, yo, shut the fuck up. He's like, oh, here's my rival that, you know, someone's trying to hit on you. And you're like, it's like, go away. He's, Dude, he's, he, fucking... he's supposed to be bravado personified. Mm. <laughs> That's a cute little bitch. <laughs> he's, That's a, what I can say, right? yeah, he's a bravado personified. Okay, whatever. Which is like the tra like you see that this is the traditional Gundam <laughs> or that type of hmm. character. Douchebag. Yeah, douchebag, douchebag character. Douchebag. The Chad. Um, Bob. What? <laughs> Seven. What are your experiences with Gundam? So I've only seen two. Okay. On the IBO. Okay. Want to watch that one? Gundam Wing. The movie. Yeah, which movie? The oh, endless, the Gundam endless Wing. Waltz, uh, yeah. And then I've seen. Part of the original, but it was so old that I didn't want to finish it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I said that same thing when I was watching the whole thing. Yeah, like, yeah oh like, my god, dude, I this fucked is, up. Yeah, I'm like, uh -huh. mm, nah, too old to finish. Skip. Uh, I've seen random episodes of the shitty ones. Uh, like, oh, like, SD. Tiny, like Tiny Gun. Oh. And like build, build yeah, divers. I you were going to be killed. I was like, oof. They're, they're ass. <laughs> of course they are. <laughs> I said, Daddy, I'm like, I think the next, the only Gundam I should watch from now on is Gundam Build stuff, because, you know. <laughs> As D and Build. I'll just, I'll rate all of Gundam off of those two shows. Oh. <laughs> I mean, Wing has the nostalgia factor. Yeah. 
Wings, I think the first one I watched. Yeah, I like, was, I like the story the most though. Uh, uh, yeah, I like uh, Wings. Wings fun, right? You you got you got the dick main protagonist, but it's it's fun. Not just <laughs> he's a fun dick. He's a fun dick. <laughs> he's a fun dick. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's, he's the meanest <laughs> shit. <laughs> I've learned that from Gundam. The the small things I've watched. All the main characters are wor- are worst characters. See, I I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't think that's, here. Yeah, I don't think that's always true. They're all kind of dickish in their own way, but you have like silent like silent protagonists, kind of like edgy boy, because that, that that's I a big one in a lot of them. Like IBO, like, like, like IBO. IBO. Uh, I didn't like that one. Uh, I like the friend. Yeah, but he wasn't the main boy. Do you like Mikazuki? Which one's that one? The kid. Now he like the, the, the kid. pilot. The now he was too edgy. Because <laughs> uh, because Setsun is the same way. The one from Double O. He's also edgy. He's also the edgy boy. Oh my god. <laughs> and he's the edgy boy. Well, no, because there's like he no he's silent edgy boy, and then there's like depressed edgy boy in that one, <laughs> okay. and then there's fun character, <laughs> okay, okay. and then they're a smart douchebag. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, <okay. laughs> that's like that's like the double O protagonists. Which Gundam is the one that they have like all the important people trying to run away in a spaceship and then he gets blasted out of the sky, which negates the whole show. Like he was trying to save them and then they die. Is that Seed? Have you seen Seed? I thought you saw Seed. Shit, I seen Seed. <laughs> <laughs> It was just, I didn't like it, so maybe I just, like, blocked it out of my mind. <laughs> <laughs> I was just like, wait a minute, we've talked about Gundam Seed before. You've seen Seed. <laughs> I've seen both of them. Because it's, like, oh, so, Yeah, because Seed Destiny, well, Seed Destiny is straight fucking garbage, though. <laughs> <laughs> Normal Seed's bearable. Seed See, Destiny is straight fucking so garbage. You're telling me, is I go from what I've watched to Gundam Seed, and I can rate this as low as I want. <laughs> And then you watch the bills. <laughs> Gundam, but, Gundam, from what I'm hearing, is like a like a three on the scale of ten. Like Gundam all over. Oh, okay. Like overall, yeah, it's yeah. pretty hit. It's, 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 it's very hit. Uh, it's it's very hit. Miss IBO is very good though. It is pretty good. IBO is very good. That's the one that tilted me the most. That's one I wanted to watch, but you know, it took me forever to go through. Fucking, uh-huh. I guess it'd be. Uh, so two, four, six, eight, ten hours of content and, within and a this week. This is worse. It's fifty episodes. It's, it is fifty. It's, yeah, two seasons. Two seasons. Of twenty-four. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing but tilt. <laughs> no, no. The first season's hype. The, the second, second season's <laughs> nothing but tilt. <laughs> it's very fucking sad. <laughs> <laughs> it's it, it, it it's almost like a because there's an older Gundam that's the same way. It, sure. it, it, it's 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 called Zeta Gundam because Zeta Gundam is also very like a. Infamous for also being a tilt ride. <laughs> Nothing. I'll go uh, back to my happy. There's quite shows. a few of them. You see, Thailand has a lot of those because they're all they're all they're war films. Yeah, that's right. basically what they are. They're just yeah, because like when you start going into like War in the Pocket, which is I think eighty three and then eighty or I think Eighth MS Team is another one that's in use. They're all like they're all tilt. They're all tilt fests. Right. <laughs> The okay, original one wasn't tilting. No, that kind of wing isn't that tilting. Yeah. No, no one, I don't feel like the no one dies. I don't feel like the extended universe ones are as tilting. Yeah, because seeds. Well, this, the ending kind of is. Uh, I was just like, bro, <laughs> yeah. you did all of this, and did they fucking die anyway? <laughs> yeah, that one is. Yeah, uh, IBO <laughs> definitely is. Double uh, O's not. I mean, it has its moments. Yeah, where it's kind of like that. I'm trying to think of the other extended universe ones. There's not that many. Well, Wing, Wing, and the Wing's not. No, really. the one important dies. Yeah, Wing, I don't think is that. Is that tilting? They almost die. Yeah, and those yeah, are like the only normal. big ones I could think because all the other ones I'm thinking of in my head are all you see. Yeah. So. There's a lot. No shit. <laughs> when I type in Gundam on my anime list, it scrolls for a fucking while. And I'm like, who watches all these and why? <laughs> not, why? At the, not at the same time. You just take like 20 years to watch all of them. Yeah, why they're coming out I with mean, like I, a I new did, one I mean, every I year. I've been watching Gundam for quite a while. <laughs> Is that Gundam every year? Pretty no. much. Pretty much. I mean, we haven't had... Oh, well. Yeah. No. No, maybe. I I'm forgot. I sure. forgot. I, I think. I think recently year. though, they're mostly just they, they're mostly ovas. 
Oh, yeah. That's usually what it is. It's OVAs and films. There, I mean, the last full series was IBO. Yeah. Because between that, I think there was just... It was Thunderbolt, which might have been before... I, Thunderbolt's before second season of IBO, I think. Oh. Uh-huh. And then... Which is only... It's a four... Ep- well, now it's like 12 episodes. Because I think there's three seasons of it. Each, each season's only four episodes. Oh. Because <laughs> it was just like an OVA, like an hour-long OVA, basically. Uh-huh. Uh, and then Narrative was an OVA that came out, which is a sequel to Unicorn. It was a movie. Garbage. I'm pretty sure there's one here. <laughs> I'm looking at these dates. Is there? It, it almost looks like it. It's going to jump to 99, 07, 95, 2002, 13, 79, 80, or sorry, 2008, uh, 2018, 2014, 2015, 20, uh, 96, uh, 85, 2010, no date, 96, Oh, 14, 94, 19, 15, I like how 86. it's not in order. No. <laughs> no it's just early. 2007, Because I think it's alphabetical. Yeah, <laughs> but I can probably Google. You know which one you should watch, Bob? Which one? G-Savior. Because it's a meme one. I'm going to look it up. <laughs> yeah, it's G-Savior. G-Savior? Uh, Gundam G-Savior. Does it look derpy? <laughs> it's... Bro, it's a PlayStation 2 game. <laughs> no. <laughs> When it come out? 1999? Yeah, dude. Bruh. This is not an order. What the fuck? I don't know where my phone is. It's non-existent. I don't have it. So. <laughs> <It's lost>. <laughs> <laughs> we all know that. Disappeared. <laughs> Did you also hide it? But I think it's I think it's G-Savior. Yeah. With the, God, with the God Gundam. I think it's what it's called. It's great. Shining finger. Yep, that's the shining <laughs> that's the shining finger one. <laughs> okay. I, I got it, guys. I got it. So original Gundam. 79 to 82. Okay. Then he, then we do have a break for Zeta. So 85 to 86. Yeah, Zeta. And, but then there's complimentary movies in 05 and 06. Then we have... So, so double from, Zeta. So yeah, double, double Z. Yeah, I guess yeah. double Zeta. So 86 ends and 86 picks up again to 87. Uh-huh. Then after 87, you have 88. Then after 88, you have five movies from 88 to 89. Skip a few years. To, oh, no, no, there's OVAs in between, sorry. So, 88 to 93, and there's 86. Then from 91 to 92 is the Stardust Memories, and 93 oh, is Vic- Victory one. Gundam, then uh-huh. G Fighters, 94 to 95, then Gundam Wing is 5 to 6. From 6 to 9 is Gundam 8th MS Team. Yeah, 8th MS Team. Then you have a 2013 Special. You have Gundam X, which is in between all this. <laughs> then you have After War Gundam X. I don't know. I had never watched that one. Then you have Gundam from 97 to 98, which is still no breaks. This uh-huh. is, I've been straight through. Gundam Wing Endless Waltz. Hell yeah. And from 99 to 2000 to 2000 is Gun- Turn a Gun Gundam. Turn a Gundam. Turn a Gundam. Yeah. I don't know why that's weird to say. Then you have Gundam Savior in 2000. 2001 is Gundam Neo. Experience double eighty seven green drive driver. I've never watched that one. And from 01 to 07, you have Gundam Evolve. Never watched that one either. Then from 02 to 04, you have Mobile Suit Gundam Seed. I've seen that one. Then from 03 to 04 is Gundam Defense. Uh, sorry, Superior Defender no, Gundam I Force. I haven't seen that one. 04, you have Gundam Suit Gundam or Mobile Suit Gundam MS Igloo: The Hidden One Year War. I've seen that. One. Then 04 to 06, you have Destiny. Uh-huh. Or see Destiny. Yeah. From 06, <laughs> you have Igloo something, another one. 06, you still have Stargazer. Uh, 07 to 09, you have Gundam Double O. Uh-huh. 09, you have Grand Gravity Front. Front, yeah. From 2010 to 2014, you have Unicorn. Yeah, us. <laughs> you got a shit ton of stuff in 2010. I'm not even going to go over. 11 to 13, you have Gundam Ace. Your age, sorry. Yeah, I got an age. Then you got build is thirteen to fourteen. Best one. <laughs> fourteen to fifteen, you have uh, some word I'm not gonna say. And then you have build again, original in twenty nineteen or twenty fifteen, yeah, twenty eighteen. Yeah, yeah. There's no breaks. There's literally Keeps no going. breaks. There's from what I'm watching here, there's about four Gundam shows a year. Between I don't know if there's shows, Ova's but, movies. Ova's movies. but that means there has not been a break of Gundam since the original you know what's crazy? Gundam. That's all Sunrise. Yeah. And Sunrise like goes out and does other stuff at the same time. Well, it's called having more than one development. I know, <laughs> I know, because like in like '99, they did Cowboy Bebop. Yeah. Is theirs as well? Uh, 
the weird one, the weird one to me, the weirdest one Sunrise does, because you have Gundam, and then their other, like, top franchise sure. is Love Live. Love Live by Sunrise? <laughs> yep. What uh, the fuck? I, I do this. Dude, no wonder they can produce a Gundam show every, every year. <laughs> yep. Do it. We just, every half a year. We just Dude. got money. They got money. Between, like, Gumpla sales yep. and, like, the Love idol stuff, stuff. Bruh, <laughs> they got money up the wazoo. I would argue that they are more... They have probably more money than the Fate series has. That that, that company. Uh, Tight Moon? Yeah. I'd easily say they have more. I'd say double. They might. Because how I mean, much do you think they sell via Gundam and Love Live oh, they make compared shit, to Fate? They make shit <laughs> I mean, Fate has Fate Geo, which is their, their big... They're big fucking money pusher. But <laughs> yeah, but I still think what? Fade Geo? Uh I don't know, I still think Gundam and Love Live can out push <laughs> it probably does. <laughs> Fate Sun- any day. Yep, Sunrise is I'd rather not, but <laughs> <laughs> Sunrise has its uh <laughs> They have money. They they, got they money. will never bankrupt. Uh-huh. It's okay, they'll pay their employees like ten bucks a year, but that's fine. They had dude. Fun, fun, fun I'm going to call Sunrise and tell them to stop putting out Gundams. It's never going to stop. There's two, already two more movies in the works. <laughs> already? <laughs> those, well, those of course, you have the two Hathaway movies still. Yeah, there's two more. It's so a trilogy. I'll, I'll probably be out this year. I'm going to guess both of them. Yeah, because the, the, the one that came out now was supposed to be last year. Yeah. And then COVID shoved it over this year. But What was that company that does... Uh, what was it called? Um... Fate? Titan Moon. Moon. Uh, well, they don't show me their spending, but yeah. okay, Sunrise made about $2 billion last year. Uh-huh. Okay. But Titan Moon made $5 billion, $4 billion on just FGO. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> That's I, bullshit. I don't think, I don't, I don't, well, I mean, I don't know if Sunrise gets a little bit more now because there are some Gundam games and stuff like that. Well, that I mean, it's not it's out. not the same I don't know why Gundam the power fate you. <laughs> I, I don't know. I think if Gundam had a gacha game, I think it would push There back. is one. Which one? I can't, you know, I can't. Gundam builds fucking mobile game. I think so. It's like a fighting. Yeah, it's, a it's a fighting game. one. Uh, but fighting yeah. ones don't fucking count. Yeah. This is not a gacha game. I mean, this is probably just a game. Yeah. There, well, there's one that's a game, but I can't remember. There is a mobile one. Is there? Yeah. Is it a gacha game or is it a fucking just a uh, game? Uh, it might just be a game. Uh, if it's just a game, it's like Gundam Battle Gunpla or something like that. Battle. Gundam, yeah. Gundam uh, phone game. Phone case? You want a phone case? I like I like the the PS4 oh. game. Oh yeah, only the new one for like forty five minutes. Yeah, the new one. Yeah, this is the beat 'em up. Yeah. Yeah, that's not a fucking. That's not um, a money maker. No, oh, who buys fighting games? You can't waifu up the. the you can't waifu up with Gundam. I mean, you can waifu well, up the idols. Well, you do. Yeah. yeah, that's true. Dude, how much? That there, I think there, fucking... there probably is a love life. Yeah, but it's, <laughs> it's, it's a it's a touch game. It's that rhythm. It's that rhythm game. Oh, it's a it's rhythm not, game. Um, yeah, it's not a. As we were just talking about. The gotcha game. Gotcha game. It's just a rhythm game. Oh, okay. So, you know, you pay probably like 20 bucks for the whole game. And yeah. I'm sure maybe new event, song eventually they'll be, they'll be like, we'll, we'll make, make a gotcha. Or maybe they're Ooh. not as greedy and they're like, nah, fuck that. Slam them together. So we have a Gundam Love Live game. And it's a gotcha you game. Me- you mechify the idols. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I'm hey, sure hey Sunrise. Like I, <laughs> I got you guys. <laughs> I got you great. <laughs> You give me 1% of how much you're obviously <laughs> going to make, and I'll be set for the rest of my life. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. But I was they're, a shadow of that. They're, <laughs> they're missing out on free money. Because I think you, what you do, you do like the Pokemon thing. Where Did you see the gacha game that Pokemon put out? Pokemon Go? No, not that one. There's a, a game where you, you can get certain Pokemon, but they come with a trainer. Okay, I, don't know how uh, I think so. But I remember they put out a game like that. And you do the same thing. You have the mech suit, but you have the girl with it, so you can hear her voice lines, and uh, you can slam her around different places. Did you play that garbage? No. <laughs> <laughs> I just saw it, and I'm like, yeah, more money for that company that definitely needs it. <laughs> What's well, that company that makes the Pokemon games? Oh, fuck. Niantic? No, they're the one that does Pokemon That's Go. That's Pokemon Go. That's Pokemon Go. Game Freak. Nintendo. Is it Game Freak? It might be Game Freak. You might have got they used to be. Because Nintendo's the publisher. Yeah. Uh-huh. Might be Game Freak. Game Freak? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. We have oh, they're rolling. 
Well, you're saying Pokemon's a billion dollar franchise? <laughs> <laughs> what? No. Uh, it has what? Been forever. I got ten dollars, and I bet you I can. Dude, buy you it. can't even buy cards at Target or any store. <laughs> How much money can they be possibly made? Nothing. Oh, I, 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 I sorry. I just remembered something with the with the Gundam stuff, but uh, uh, because sure. I, I mean, Gundam has a partnership with Netflix. Right? Sure, sure. Yeah, that's so that's why that's money. yeah that's why the Hathaway yeah. films there, and eventually at some point, the movie which I do not want to come out and. Why are you speaking so slow? Is so live <laughs> is a live action Gundam is supposed to come out on Netflix as well. We oh! will. <laughs> Everyone, we will watch it and we will review it. <laughs> Not against Even my will. It, no, I, I want to watch it. <laughs> I will watch it because. I don't care about Gundam, so <laughs> it's, it's gonna, gonna not hurt it's me. It's gonna hurt. So I don't know, man. The, the, it's gonna hurt the so much. Live action. Well, it was CG, I guess. It was in that movie. Uh, Ray Player One. Oh. Uh, and they're pretty okay. Yeah, but that was like, yeah. here's the well, Gundam. Like five seconds. <laughs> he walked across the town. <laughs> this oh. is Gundam fighting Mechagodzilla, and then uh, that's it for like five seconds. Yeah. I, I can't wait for it. Because I want to see Eddie die. It's gonna I'm all rated gonna like a 10. So our average view, like score goes up yeah. just be, just to hate him. Because yeah, there's, there's all... I mean, it's funny because there's a lot of more like... Gundam related stuff coming out too. Yeah. yeah. Like uh, Ace has just released a whole bunch of. Wait, Gundam still putting out stuff? I know. Oh my god. Uh, they released a whole bunch of computer parts that were gonna. Oh have wait, it's like Gundam with. I assume it's gonna be with like American actors or what? Like yeah. Americanized Gundam? Uh huh. Well, Gundam's it. American already. Come on. What? <laughs> it's from space. Okay. <laughs> So the aliens? Yeah. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know, man. I mean, they evolve, remember? They yeah, have that's fucking true, that's true. intuition uh -huh. powers. That's what you get from going into space. All the astronauts, they can dodge anything you throw at them. So they just expect to you, you, you them. <laughs> you put them in a mobile suit up there and they'll fucking dodge bullets and shoot lasers and Makes no hit people sense. that no one else would be able to see. I could see your body evolving, but it's not going to evolve the way that evolves. We have space it. powers, dude. Oh, you're gonna have, you know what you're going to Space powers. You might be able to survive in space. Where That's their why. brain can do dude. more things, and you can, like, control, like, five different individual oh, things in your God. brain. So if Modern so Warfare cool. was in Gundam, like, suits or robots, I would have joined the military. <laughs> I don't care if I die, I'm in a robot. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go! This is my dream. <laughs> <laughs> this Wait, is my dream. You should, so you should move to Japan and be the guy that activates the Gundam suit every hour? <laughs> it does the little, like... Eh, 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 oh, like, the, the one in Yokohama? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's, he'd be like... This is my day job. I press this button every half hour. I so think go on. <laughs> there's three of them now in the world, right? One in China. Yeah, there's one the Chi China. The China one is yeah. the Gundam Seed one. Yeah. I think it's the Freedom Gundam uh -huh. from Seed. And then obviously there's the Unicorn in Odaiba. Uh -huh. And then the Granddaddy one in Yokohama. Yeah. Mm. And uh, which one was the newest one? Was it the, the one that the newest one? Where? Because I think the seed one is the one that... The one in Japan that we... we it's the, it's the granddaddy one. Is that the granddaddy mm -hmm. one? Well, if, if you want to see a video of the granddaddy one, there's a... You watch Paolo in Japan. Oh, no. He'll tell you everything about it. <laughs> Shout out to him. Then we're having on this show, dude. Free, free <laughs> plug. <laughs> Dude, his merchandise is top tier. <laughs> <laughs> it is, bro. You will buy it one day. One day. <laughs> Yeah, look at all this free <laughs> advertising. <laughs> we clip this, we tag him. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's got more we, viewers? We, we got you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we watch you every week. Okay, we, haven't, we haven't done that. We're, we're well behind. We're, we've, been, we've been busy. We've been playing games. And You're right. Moving. Yeah. Uh -huh. This might be the last time in this suit. In this studio. 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 In this, uh, in this basement room. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> can't wait. Can't wait. But <laughs> so we'll see what the new setup looks like. But yeah, it'll be interesting. Anyway, uh, I might put pictures of the Gundam that we, we all saw in Japan. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, 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 you remember that, right? Yeah, I remember. You remember seeing the transformation scene the unicorn did? Yeah, I do remember. remember how they played the opening for the original <laughs> Gundam? Yeah. yeah, it lit up, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was great because we went, we went like, like, one of the last days we were in Japan. It was like dark out. It was cool in the dark. Was I don't think I would want to see it during the day. No. 
Because you don't get the lights. Oh. It's dope as fuck. You remember the Gundam store we went to? It had like the kind of like the museum the there, and it showed you how they made the shit. <laughs> yeah, I remember. Are you me? <laughs> <laughs> I remember when Eddie bought all those Gundams, and he's like, "We, we got to see this cool like." What would you consider those? Oh, like, I put it in my in my in my uh, my suitcase. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah I remember. Yeah, then he carried his. I remember. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Through the plane. Like. Yeah, that's where this guy came from. Don't you remember? He fucking carried him. But you don't remember? He saw all the cool ones that like they paint them and stuff. And then he's like, "I'm gonna do this." So he bought a compressor. Three years use. ago. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm pretty sure it has more dust than it has use. <laughs> it is clean. Because oh, it has to be clean? moved. <laughs> <laughs> He'll use it eventually. When? Well, I mean, for I, what? I, I have a garage now to do stuff in. <laughs> when? <laughs> Couple months. <laughs> no, no. When are you going to do the stuff? A couple of years? Maybe. <laughs> in the winter. I'll figure it out. In the winter? It's going to be cold as fuck. I don't want to be in the garage. <laughs> I'll figure it out. You figure it out. He said that about two years ago. I remember when he said he's going to build this whole booth. He's going to open the window over there to spray paint. <laughs> But, I'll figure it out. But I remember, I remember the big key was he couldn't get the paints. And then we found the paints. Oh, that's <laughs> right. Remember that, that was on Christmas. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We found the paints at a, you know, like a, a hobby shop. A hobby shop. Uh -huh. <laughs> it was like, fuck. I'm not going to do shit. <laughs> and yeah, it's still not done. I really wanted that Gundam Wing figurine or whatever it's called. Gunpla? Gunpla. It was a huge box. Should have bought it, my dude. It's like three hundred bucks. Yeah. Oh, the, the the perfect grade one. Yeah. yeah. It's like the fucking that big. It would have been that size. Yeah. Fuck. Because yeah. that's a perfect grade. I've only built one that was given to me for Christmas when I was like eight, and it was like I think it was like this big. Do you want one? Hmm. I wonder which one I have. Cause I have. So I have a small. You one got the same fucking one I do. Do I? You have the Sinanju. No. You have the clear Sinanju from AX. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's just sitting unopened. Unopened? Yeah. yeah. I don't want to build it. I'm like, eh. I built, I think I have two built. But they're all like the smaller, clear ones. Uh-huh. It's That one's also a small one. No, I mean like the like super small oh, ones. Oh, the SDs. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, yeah, I'll get these. Ooh. I'll make them fight each other. Clank, clank. <laughs> Smash them, the pieces fly over. Like, I'm like, which one goes to what? And you just start mixing and matching. Yeah, dude, I'm going to pretend they're in space. And just, yeah. <laughs> you, start, you start kit bashing them. That'd be cool. I start a stop animation um, channel. <laughs> That's what's good about the IBO ones. All the IBO Gunpla. Because oh, they, nice they all use the same frame. Oh. Because, you know, in, in lore and... Anime. And, you know, <laughs> they all use the same frame, so you can mix and match a whole bunch of shit. I've seen some people do some cool stuff with them. That's pretty good. I like that idea. I feel like if you watch IBO, you'll watch the first season. And you get about halfway to the second one, you'll be like, I can't do this. No, no. Oh, no, yeah, about half. Yeah. Yeah, he'll get to halfway. Th yeah. Uh, halfway and then he'll the drop it. One. But see what Netflix has? The 1.5 speed. So I can watch anything. No, no, that's, that, that's not what I mean. You could not no, 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 get through code kiosks. But I can speed. You're <laughs> laughing. I can speed tilt myself. The so okay. problem, okay. problem is if I watch uh, the other one, uh -huh. whatever you said, I can't watch that because I can't speed it. I'd have to sit through the stress all of the time. It's I mean, it is on Netflix. You can is it on Netflix? Yeah. I don't know. It's been on It's been on there for a bit. Uh, whatever. It's too late now. I'm already 5,000 seasons behind of some shows I gotta catch See, up but on. they give you a little cushion in between tilts. But if you just speed run the whole tilt, it's just like a huge You're massive You're just ramming tilt. into each <laughs> tilt. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Once I finish it, it's over. Oh, okay. Then you Please go so. watch some wholesome. Yeah. So the one making a 2,000 more wholesome shows. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. You got anything else on your Gundam? I mean, I, I mean, there's uh, no, there's only so much, right? I've we're seen, in a fight on Ava or Gundam. Ava. I mean, Ava's like twice the size of a Gundam, so. But if you cut the umbilical cord, it shuts down. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> oh, who has the better wife? Who's Ava or Gundam? Ava. I, I, I don't know, man. It depends what Gundam. So we're, Gundam we're doing every Gundam versus Only Ava. Ava. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, because the chicks in Double O are pretty great. Choose your favorite Gundam, and then you compare waifus. The chicks in Double O are pretty great. <laughs> I don't know, man. Can't beat Ava. Can't beat Ava. Mm, nah. First chicks. <laughs> Best boy. <laughs> Kaworu? 
Yeah. 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 <laughs> the white haired kid. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely not main character. Oh, I thought you were going to say uh, Gendo, your best boy. Which one's Gendo? His best dad. His dad? Oh, <laughs> oh my. God. You know the the yeah, the, 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 the Chad. Is, the is Chad. that what he is? He's a Chad. Yeah, he's a Chad. I guess. Where he banged the lady, made her go crazy, and insert her brain into a computer, and then banged her daughter. <laughs> Wait, eighteen years later? <laughs> Wait, no. He banged the clone of his wife. No, 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 because he banged. Oh, the dog. oh yeah, she, he banged the doctor. Yeah. I, I did. Yes, yeah, like, you remember that. I now. was like, like the mom? Like, bro. No, no, because obviously Shinji's mom. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Okay, okay. And then there was the doctor who made the Magi system. Yeah. Yep, there's that yeah, one. Yeah. And then her daughter. <laughs> and then she committed some Doku. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Evangelion. <laughs> he was a Chad. He's a Chad. <laughs> so what I've learned from, from watching, imagine all the guy or the the Mecha shows I have. I don't like Mecha. <laughs> so I'm just gonna put that out there. It's not a good genre. I love it. I love it. <laughs> you see like two Gundams. You can't say. Well, you said stuff. Mecha. Yeah, that, that that's opens a lot the doors. Of you like Darling in the Franks? I don't like that. <laughs> like, no. I have seen it. <laughs> but he's seen others. I've seen others. You've seen Valvray the Liberator. I love that oh, show. That one's fucking great. It's <laughs> uh, unknown as like an OVA. It's like three movies. It's pretty great. Uh, the Red Baron, dude. It's pretty great. It's old as fuck. Mm -hmm. Name ones I've never even heard of. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I feel like everything I've seen has been eh. In my eyes. Uh -oh. Besides Gurren Lagan, but that's... Oh, Gurren Lagan. Nah, Gurren Lagan. Uh, there's one, there's like five like five kids. They're in space, obviously, an academy. That one's pretty good. Sure, sure. <laughs> Do you ever watch Aquarian? Or Aquarian Evil? Not fast that show. Oh. <laughs> uh, Is it Eure good? Yeah, it's, it's decent. Uh, uh, Eureka 7. Eureka 7. I yeah, like that show. I like that show. <laughs> I <have a> manga. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Should I go through my You want Eureka 7? No. What? So good. That show is so good. That was so good. They're like 86. That was okay. <laughs> uh, the, make a show. <laughs> that doesn't count. That counts. That's spiders. It's exactly what the mecha shows are. <laughs> it's just a war movie, but like with the, less the, war. The, the first two episodes of Total Eclipse. <laughs> are you right? Are you <laughs> right? That's the one I really did like. You know what I'm saying? I guess scroll. I like that one. Where it's like an isekai, but this dude limbs magic. Called Nights and Magic. That one, I really like that. Oh, one. Cowboy Bebop, that's a great. Oh, uh, one of my my all time favorites, uh, Escafone is a mecha. Escafone is a mecha as well. What's, what else is out there? Just so I'm trying to I'm trying to scroll through what I've there's seen. There's a there's a lot I can I I've seen that obviously you guys haven't. And Full Metal Panics, decent. Full Metal Panics, I. Uh, Code Geass. Code Geass, obviously. Yeah, obviously. Evangelion. It was good. Pat, Le Pat Labor's good. Guilty Crown is not a mecha There's show. mechas. There is mechas. mechas. Uh, Infinite Stratos. I have seen that. It's I, is that really mecha, though? It's ass, though. They wear, like, <laughs> suits. Oh, you know what else is that? Elden Noah Zero. Oh, yeah. That yeah, one, yeah. yeah, that was not Garbage. Great. That one's not great. Uh, that one's not Was that Dragon Show kind of mechas? Because, you know, they had... They're kind of like mechas. Dragon Pilot? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, if that counted as Mecha, sure, that's oh, a good show. <laughs> that's something, that's something Gargantia. Oh, that was not great either. It's fucking ass. Well, it's funny, because the last two you said are by Jin. Yeah, but they're ass. I know. I'm just saying. I read that people just take his name to get I've heard that, too. And that there's not really him. Yeah, I've heard so that. Like, I've, okay. I've heard that, too. It, 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 it makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. I guess standalone <laughs> comp, or... Um, I'm a sister, just in a little complex. Uh, what's it called? Ghost and Show. Ghost and Show. That's a mecha. Pro Mary's a mecha? Of course, of course it, it is. is. Nah. They're in giant <laughs> mechs. <laughs> so is Ghost in the Shell a mecha? Because they have shitty ass fucking spider tanks that you love. But they're automated. Still, it don't matter. Automated fucking. I, I, I think I, I would consider Ghost in the Shell to be more like standard sci fi. Because if that were the case, you would say like uh, Psychopaths is also that way as well. Is there heavy robots on that? Uh-huh. Yeah. I don't remember, though. Is yeah. Heavy Object a, a mecha? Heavy Object is a mecha. It's shitty, though. It is shitty. It's opening as fire, though. 
<laughs> that's how they get straight fired. That's how they get you. Uh, yeah. The the fucking Star right. Driver. Oh, I remember Star Driver. I didn't like that show. I, I can't either. find the one show. I want to talk Comet about. Lucifer. I remember that show. Fuck that show too. Fuck that show too. True. <laughs> I've learned I've seen too much garbage on here. <laughs> um, oh, that was a good movie. Oh, no, no, you've seen Macross. Macross is so good. Breakblade, that's what it's called. I really like that show. The I, 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 I can't remember it's Raccoon. Oh, uh, and then something I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I can't remember which one it is. The Chupio show is it here? <laughs> the Chupio show. <laughs> that is show is oh. not a mech. <laughs> Expelled from Paradise. They Expelled from Paradise. Yeah, that was a good one too. I like that one. Yeah. Right back. Did you ever watch that one? Uh, Bro, I don't know if it considers a mecha. It's a weird pseudo. Oh. Apple seed. Well, Apple seed. I forgot. Oh one. yeah, that one's. I do like that one. It's okay. Uh, Jin Rose. Kind of mecha. Captain Earth. Yes, yeah. Because they have the mechanized suits. Yeah. Sonic X a mecha. Yes. Yes. Because <laughs> what's his face? Drives one. <laughs> that might be my favorite mecha of all time. <laughs> He's like, I gotta Doctor, go fast. Dr. Yeah. Eggman in the, the fucking suit. I'm tilted. I can't find that one show. I'm trying to remember which other mecha I enjoy. Oh, did you know? I can't remember if it's Macross Frontier. Or one of the other ones that one of the, the English voice actors is Brian Cranston. Oh, oh really? Yeah. That's when, when he was first coming up, he took like some voice acting jobs and he's in there. <laughs> I can't find it. That means I'm missing something on my list. Oh, oh Burst Angel. That's one that you should watch. Uh, I don't know, man. I've seen a lot of Mecca. Zoids? Yeah, I've seen a lot. But yeah, man. Uh, speaking of Evangelion, though, I just. Uh, yeah, it was on there. I know, I just noticed something. Oh, well, I didn't notice. I knew this. But, Bob. It's fucking coming out. In a month. <laughs> we're going to be able to watch it, Bob. Bob time, dude. The final film. Remember when we thought it was going to come out in 2015? Because we thought that made sense. That makes sense. It's the, it's the anniversary. Yeah. And, well, that's, that's when the third impact happened. Sense. Yeah, I'm like, it's going to make perfect sense. Mm. Here we are six years wait, later. Wait, wait, What happened in 2015? Nothing. Nothing. The, the movie just probably we went to war did with Haramid die in 2015 that was 16 oh it was the year after you just google what happened in 2015 <laughs> <laughs> but that was the time when Hideak the Annual was having his depressed fest I thought he always has his depressed fest okay it was it was worse oh, okay. it was his hiatus <laughs> depressed fest god damn before he before he did Shin Godzilla got to movie yep <laughs> dude his other movies though I'm so excited <sighs> Shin Ultraman this year and then Shin Kamen Rider next year? Shit. <laughs> I do have to rewatch the Evangelion movies. Not because I need to, but because I want to. <laughs> Before we watch the fourth one? Yeah, it's not like I don't remember what happens, yeah. but I want to watch it. Just so it makes sense. Nothing really happened this year. That year. But yeah, dude. Well, I guess there's a lot of things that happened. But it me. comes out on August 13th. Soon. On Amazon Prime! Soon. I hope it's not ass. It's gonna be ass. I haven't I haven't seen any reviews. I haven't either. I haven't seen any spoilers. No. Nope. I saw just what it made. Like money wise? Not very much. Yeah. Like, it did pretty good. Yeah, it probably did good. I because... mean it was obviously competing with a uh, fucking Fucking shitty ass Demon Slayer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was competing with Demon Slayer, but it's not shitty, but fuck that movie. <laughs> <laughs> did you watch it finally? No. <laughs> Well, it's, on it's, like, it's on Funimation, right? I've, yeah. I've been meaning to just sit down and watch it. I was going to bootleg it. I mean, what? <laughs> but it's on Funimation. <laughs> on Funimation. It, huh? He my, does. I do. Uh, my plan is a speedrun Demon Slayer. So I can watch the movie. <laughs> <laughs> there's movies that just recap the whole show, I think. Yeah, no, but I want to watch the fucking show. I, I think there's only the show. The show's probably on like a 9.5 on I'm probably in my anime list. It's not good until after the end of the first season. Yeah, but you know, people have small brains and they only talk about... I think it's good from the halfway point on. Yeah. That's what he's just saying. Yeah, the first part is just like, yeah. it is so fucking... That's why I dropped it. When it, when it was simulcast and like, well, boring as well. This, it, when, it start, when I started, I'm like, this is a standard shonen. Just mm-hmm. with some fancy, fancy crap, crap. table stuff. Yeah. With you complaining about the first half, what do you think it's rated? The first half? No, the whole thing. The whole thing? I don't know. Like, uh, pretty high. Nine. Yeah, or an 8. 8.5. Yeah. Mm-hmm. The movie's 8.7. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Makes sense. Sounds like the average... Sounds like small brain. Viewer. Yeah, small brain. <laughs> small brain. Not thinking about how bad the first half of shit is. And they're like, oh, that, that last half is really good. 
<laughs> Let's bump it to a 12. It's more of like a, oh, action, yeah. 10 out of 10. Small brain. Small brain. Small brain. Yeah. <laughs> that second half, though. That second half is the so second half's a banger. <laughs> you say the first half doesn't matter, so it's a 10? No. You can I watch mean, the first two episodes. But the and first. And then you skip. <laughs> yeah. Because yeah. the, the first half isn't bad, it's just. Boring. Boring. Yeah. And then and then it's and then it's hype. And then you're like, oh, you start getting to know all the bad uh -huh. guys. And like, okay, yeah, start fighting and shit. Sounds like all showing them. Yeah. The beginning's always a little slow. Yeah. Yeah. And then once it starts, when once the ball starts rolling, and then yeah, and then it never stops. And then it just keeps going, <laughs> which is because season two was announced, I think, too, as well. Right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, it just that. keeps going. I'm ready for the tilt. I'm ready for the tilt. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. But I don't think it'll get that far. Nah, damn it! Don't say that. <laughs> yeah, I don't think it'll get that far. Damn. Because I, I I feel like that's like another two seasons worth of stuff. Mm. Am I wrong? No, no, yeah, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> just skip that. <laughs> and like, am I wrong? <laughs> I'm like remembering what arcs come up next. <laughs> I'm just like, am I wrong? <laughs> Eddie won't watch it. Eddie won't watch it. He's like, I read it. I don't need to watch it. I read. No, it, so that 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 is one. I, I I feel like when watching the show, compared to what like the manga was. I, I feel like it's one of those ones where the show really elevates what the manga was. Well, viewers, put X to doubt in the comments. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. That's one I'll probably sit through. Yeah. You're going to be like, yeah, I watched it. I forgot. I don't have time. He's like, I'm three episodes behind. Nah. My schedule's <laughs> too busy. <laughs> I got nothing to do. <laughs> Books to read. <laughs> Minecraft, to read. Minecraft to play. Minecraft to Skyrim. play. Let's Skyrim, Skyrim play. to play. He's back in the early thousands over here. Yeah, dude. <laughs> I never left. <laughs> Poor old man. <laughs> got any more news? I got one news story. Okay. okay. Neither about anime or Japan. The fuck? <laughs> I can't find anything this week. So, new gadget turns any alcohol into ice cream, including beer and cocktails. What? Uh, it turns it into ice cream? Yeah. I bet you it tastes like ass. The cocktails probably taste good. So like, you just put ice in... You could have a margarita ice food. cream. You could have a mojito ice cream. Mojito ice cream? I mean, they do have mojito flavor things like Rita's. Uh-huh. But that's like ice flavor. No, but mojito what if ice it's cream. like creamy? Hmm. Rum raisin? Like saying? a drunk? <laughs> No, of course you do. Yeah, because yeah. it's the, so it's alcohol. the alcohol. Shit. It turns it into a soft serve. I saw mm. that and I'm just like, that sounds good and I don't like alcohol, but I do like ice imagine, cream. <laughs> imagine uh, the Kraken in soft serve. Ooh. I feel like... <laughs> <laughs> I feel His like, eyes lit up there that's, a little that's bit. That's he becomes an alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like no, it would be so bad too. Though, cause you take a bite you're like, oh God... Oh, okay. it's so strong. <laughs> you chase it with the cone. <laughs> <laughs> I picture, I picture you have two ice creams. You have, you have, uh, you have your alcohol, and then you have your chaser. So you have a Coke one, and they're like, woo. Oh, yeah. Well, can, can, can't you just make like a fucking whiskey and Coke and make, because that's technically yeah, a cocktail, know, wait, right? And make a I soda out of that? You, you make chaser. a Rita's. Wait. Because then you put like... Just... Alcoholic Rita's? No. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. It would be uh, like a whiskey Coke flow. <laughs> <laughs> whiskey ice cream floated on Coke. <laughs> a frozen Cuba Libre? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Can't wait to buy this gadget. <laughs> Dude, if we were in a different state, we would be fucking rich. <laughs> I think we could do it here. What are you talking about? We got a main street by a fucking little a little shop. But then we need a up. fucking. We're a bar. <laughs> yeah, it's a bar. Fuck it. You just have to be twenty one and over to get in. Yeah, we're a bar that serves ice cream. That's all you do. You just gotta ID people at the door. We ID people at the our stand. <laughs> yeah. Imagine getting blasted it's like when on you, ice cream. <laughs> it's like when you go walk into a dispensary. Same shit. Ah. Well, imagine, because we're, you know, you're definitely lactose, I'm somewhat. You get fucking, you get blasted and have your lactose at you at the same time. 
<laughs> Coming out of both ends. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's end of shit. That's all I got. That's all I got for this fucking dumb shit. Uh, thank you guys for joining us on this episode. Our last episode ever. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, this is season two. Is, ah, you're right. coming up. This is end of season one. End of season one, <laughs> yep. start of season two. End of season one. Do it. So every season is six months? Every season is whenever we move. <laughs> so, so we don't move ever again. <laughs> yeah, doing, you know he's going to live in that house forever. Season one is like... <laughs> At least five years. <laughs> <laughs> season one, what, 25 episodes? And then we become uh, One Piece. We just run for it until we die. Forever. Forever. <laughs> There's no seasons anymore. It's just oh, one. It's just arcs. one big thing. <laughs> Arc one through fucking two billion. That's what the rest of the show is gonna be. Oof. <laughs> Fuck yeah. I ain't convinced the show is not never gonna end. It's not gonna. The dude is gonna I, die. I think the guy said he could keep going. Like he said he could keep going. He for has like another a while. thousand chapters. Yeah. He's gonna die before he reaches a thousand chapters, unless he has a bad log already written. He's like, in case I die, here's the last I think chapter. he has, like, <laughs> ideas written down, so uh -huh. if he does die, it's like, oh, you can pick up the mantle Dude, for another 500. How, how that man can write like that is beyond me. I hope, I hope if he... Because, maybe, maybe, because the manga has no filler. Maybe because it's so long when you forget the beginning and he just recycles... He just changes like <laughs> it's the same thing, the same, yeah. dra the same drawing too. It's yeah. like, the match looks familiar. <laughs> You just put the box in a different yeah, place, he different just, dialogue, easy. Because he just fucking, it just keeps going. It just, uh, it, there's a thousand chapters. You can take a break. You can. He's You're already rich. He's <laughs> taking a break, I think. He's taking breaks. Yeah, he's done it. He's like done sick. Because <laughs> he's sick from working <laughs> fucking 24-7 writing God. this. How do you work that much for over 20 years, dude? At some point, you gotta be like, I'm good. <laughs> dude, his body must be like 80. His mental body. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Because, <laughs> man, I, can, I can't even imagine. He can't probably, imagine. all he dreams about is Luffy. That's probably, that's all that's in his head. <laughs> yeah, he probably dreams about, uh, what's the big that's how he That's how he writes forever, dude. He has a dream about it, like, wakes up, and will write it down. Goes back to bed. It's like, <laughs> another book. <He's, laughs> every night, he just fucking lives it in his head. Jesus. You have to, to write like that. like Yeah. Because he puts out, like, a chapter a week. That's yep. insanity. What if he has some voodoo magic and he goes into like a pocket dimension where time slows down? So he eats a guys. What? Yes. He goes into a pocket <laughs> dimension where like three years there is like two minutes in our, life, in our time. And that's where he writes everything and comes back home. Like, yeah, I did it. No, I think he just sold his soul to the devil. <laughs> he, like, he pulled the David Blaine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Yeah. buy our stickers, subscribe, yeah. buy their stickers, support us. It's down below. We'll support too. our new studio. <laughs> <laughs> buy their Etsy stuff. We want to put so cool stuff on the wall. Maybe there's this Nicolas Cage thing we're looking at. That's a million dollars. So you know we got. <laughs> we want to pay an editor. <laughs> That'd be nice. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be nice. <laughs> because, you know, I'm a little lazy. But I'll jam things in when I need to. If we have an editor, we can just jam in random pictures and videos while we talk. Like like real people. Like real people, yeah. Like real people. <laughs> I don't want to sit there. I got too much shit on my plate. Yeah. Eddie okay. doesn't do anything. He should be our editor. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Forgets to upload. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> We really pushed back the date because you took forever to do the thumbnail. It's <laughs> <laughs> okay. We do Tuesdays. It's, and then it's, easy peasy. Look at our thing. It's helped out a lot. Yeah, oh. yeah. <laughs> Tuesdays, perfect time. Thank you guys. Till next time. See ya. See ya. <laughs>